Hey guys, uh, I just want to update you with uh, my condition after I came back from the John of God. Like, I think it's uh, around one year that I came from Abajania, and I just want to give the official update what's happening in my life because uh, many of you ask me did I get any healing and remember I stayed there like for a whole one year because usually people just stay for one week or they go home uh, so I had like numerous surgeries uh, felt really bad there but you know like from all the hype from Oprah and especially scammy guides that especially one guy is so scammy like woman with her uh, juicy XXX past she said that every one who goes with her gets a healing even dogs and cats like a nonsense so because of people like that I believed I could get better you know in one year but I don't know like I just feel that I might even get worse I mean my physical symptoms a little bit in improve but my mental symptoms just uh, I don't know like they shifted you know before I was so confident on one side and unconfident on the other side and now they everything like shifted so much so I don't know what are the benefits from staying there for one year I I just I'm still recuperating from all the bad stuff that happened there and from all the rudeness of the people and everything that really messed you up when you're in such a vulnerable state like meditating having an operation and then all those fucking bad people come and try to mess with you and stuff and um, like I'm still recuperating I'm still not at the same mental strength that I was before coming to Abajania so I really don't know if I will ever get to the same level as before and for the physical symptoms like I think everything is pretty much the same um, really if I'm honest I wouldn't bother going there anymore like especially for one year it's just a waste of one year just a waste of time you know you have 80 years of life and you just throw away one year and I had like such a bad time there like feeling so lonely you know nobody there was like just the mentality of people is so different there like you see very rude people that are tormented with their disease and stuff like that. You see, how can I explain that? It's just another level. And then there are all those people who are in it for the money and just want to squeeze all the money out of you if possible. You know, it's, it's I mean, there are good energies, but with good comes also all those bad, dark energies that I don't like. So. And remembering all those people coming back for years and no improvement whatsoever it's just like repeating repeating process so I think uh, it's not the ultimate solution like I just read about one guy from my country he's like collecting donations to go fix himself to Abajania he just thinks he's gonna get fixed like that's the mentality of the people I'm gonna get cured if I go there and then you see like from my experience maybe one percent or even less get like remission of cancer or a cure like that but the rest is just the same you know and people even go there to try to sell for the money problems and stuff like that like everything you have you can go there and pay you know and like those entities are like I mean I don't want to be too critical but I have my own questions you know like from being there and being a reporter myself and 
I know I can smell the BS and you know, but I I don't know what's going on. There's some really remarkable stuff there. Like people, some people get cured, I guess, but other people just get worse. You know, it all depends. Uh, that's my first video update.